Hey guys, good morning. Today is October the 3rd? Is it the 3rd? Or the 2nd? It's the 2nd. It's not the 3rd. It's the 2nd because it's Wednesday. But <laughs> I didn't film much yesterday because uh, we didn't do anything yesterday. So it was kind of a boring day. Just I cleaned the house a whole lot and mopped and stuff. And I don't think anybody really wants to see me <laughs> cleaning and mopping and stuff. And I did sit down and I worked on another pattern that I'm going, uh, that I'm writing. I actually got it wrote. I'm just doing some little tweaks to it. And uh, today I've got to work on another, my other pattern. I'll give you guys a sneak peek who haven't seen it yet. Boop! The black and white thing I showed. <laughs> I uh, It's out to testers, but i got to make another one so I can take pictures for the pattern. Progress pictures and all that. So I'm going to sit down and do that here in just a little bit. Get started on it. And I do got to go to the post office today to drop off some orders. But I don't think I got any packages. Hey, stay over there because you're in your underwear. I am. Yeah. Well, what are you doing? Mama's talking. No. He's wrapped up in his blanket. That's his blanket he's been using ever since he was born. Mommy's got washed that. It's got slime on it. <laughs> he got putty on it. But I was watching a bunch of other people's Vlogtobers yesterday, and I watched Terry's at Yarn Joy podcast, and she's going about it in a cool way. Instead of just randomly vlogging like a lot of people do, she's actually doing, she's got like a purpose to hers, <laughs> and one of them is like these little patterns, uh, scrap patterns, and so I thought that'd be fun. I'm, I might join in on that every now and then. So yesterday, her first day, she did a little baby turtle by, um... Happy Berry, and it's a free pattern on YouTube, and if I can remember, I'll link it in the description. And in my next Don't Catch Name episode, which I need to film, <laughs> um, I will link it also because I'll be showing these. But I made one out of scrap. The body is like a red heart pink scrap, and uh, the top is, the shell is, it's an I Love This Yarn, but I can't remember what it's called. This thing is called Gelato something, but um, I got mostly white out of the ball. But then, so, because I got mostly white, I wanted to use the color. So then I made the second little turtle completely out of that scrap ball. These are super fast. And, I, like, I made the first one and then I had the pattern in my head. So I made the second one while watching other YouTubers. And then I made two brown and <laughs> camouflage ones while um, just watching, trying to get caught up on YouTube videos. But um, these are super quick and easy and fun, and I might make some more today if I ever if I get tired of working on my pattern or something, and I need just like a break from strategic crochet and just do some easy crochet. I'm gonna make some more little turtles because um, they're little and cute and easy, and I can put them in my craft fair in a couple weeks and uh, just charge, you know, just a little tiny amount for them because they're. Um, little and easy and it's just scrap they only have a little tiny bit of stuff in it and most of these have ends in them too because all the ends from the previous turtle are in the next turtle and most of their heads are stuffed with uh ends so uh it's a good little scrap buster oh i just showed my pattern a little bit in the background but i got a big box down there well i got a lot of boxes but that one right there is my scrap yarns and those those bigger skeins are just the ones i've thrown on there before i put them back on the shelf these are my boxes for the craft fair that I, I got some of them done over there and I still gotta get these three done and uh, I'm a procrastinator but I'm working on everything slowly <laughs> but yeah so I found another thing that I'm gonna give away to the, whoever wins my part of the Halloween cow Claudia from Crochet Luna sent me some buttons uh, I think last year and she sent me some for myself and then some to give away so I've been holding on I've been slowly giving them away for different giveaways but then I found the Halloween one this is Boo Halloween Crochet. Um, so the winner will get that along with the bag set. And uh, I might try to find some other little things on there. I wanted to make some Halloween stitch markers. Oh yeah, I did, didn't I? The skull ones. I couldn't find any Halloween charms at Joann's or at my Hobby Lobby. Um, I think Amber from Uwa Crochet, I think she got hers at Michael's. But by the time I went to Joann's, there was like no Halloween charms. And Hobby Lobby doesn't have any at all that I could find. So, uh, I used some skulls that I had from forever ago. <laughs> That's another thing I need to do is up there my, my pink tackle box thing. I think it's a makeup box. But um, I need to get a bunch of stitch markers made up to give away to people. Because I used to always give stitch markers to people every time I sent them something. But I, I just stopped making them. <laughs> but I got a ton of supplies up there and beads and everything. So, I need to just do it. But my little turtles are so cute. I love the little camouflage ones. 
So I'm gonna make a bunch more of those turtles, I think, between now and the craft fair. And maybe some more little patterns if Terry shares some more easy ones that I could do mindlessly. They're so cute and little. Hey guys, I am sitting here. Devin just literally went out the door to work <laughs> and I've been working on one of my patterns that is being tested right now. I'm sitting here at my window. It'll focus. I don't know if you can see, but that's the window. It's got the stickers that were gifted to Jesse. They were on this other window, but I moved this shelf. So I'll move the stickers. <laughs> but um, what I do is one of my craft tables, I have it set here with, uh, this is the Halloween blanket. And I use this purple as the background for my images for my patterns. And um, I'm working on a, pr a pattern that is in testers right now. Because I'm going to try to get it out this weekend is the plan. Because it's a Halloween pattern. And i got to remake it myself to take photos for the, um, the pattern PDF. So I'm working on that right now. And I'm sitting here watching um, YouTube videos. I'm trying to get caught up on everybody. Uh, I'm still working on a lot of people's first day of Vlogtober. So I'm trying to get caught up on everything. So here I got 17 videos left to catch up on. <laughs> and uh, right now I'm watching Heather at Painted World Fiber, Fiber Arts and working on my pattern. And Jesse's in his room. He was playing the game, but he abandoned it and went to his room. So I'm going to turn back on the TV and work on this pattern and try to get it done today. And then I got a tote down here. My stuffing's sitting on top of it. But I got two patterns in there that I'm writing that I'm going to try to get done as soon as possible because I want to get them up and into my Etsy shop uh, as quickly as I can. <laughs> sitting here I'm still working on my pattern Jesse's in his bedroom I'm gonna just crochet and talk to you guys for a few minutes um, if I can focus enough to do it I just started this round so it's the small bit so I gotta get my stitch marker in today is Wednesday right or is it Tuesday what is today Wednesday yeah it's hump day hump day it's Wednesday, October 2nd, <laughs> which you guys probably already know that. I don't because I forget everything. So tomorrow's Thursday. I got to go tomorrow to do um, bill paying and all that fun stuff that we do on Thursdays. And don't really need to grocery shop because we went yesterday, I think, or the day before that and got what little bit we needed. We didn't need very much this week. We got a ton of stuff in our freezer uh, to the point where our freezer is full and I need to, we need to eat out of the freezer for a while to get rid of some of that stuff. This is making noises. But um, I'm still working on the same pattern I was a little while ago. One of my patterns that I'm hoping to get out this weekend. Uh, I'm just making it again so I can take photos of it. I'm using black yarn so it takes me a second to find where my hook goes. But um, this Saturday, Devin's supposed to work uh, you know, I work so Saturday. So Sunday, we are thinking about going to a thing in Nashville. We live about an hour and a half from Nashville. If any of you guys ever wondered how close we were to Nashville. <laughs> um, but there's a pumpkin thing. I can't remember where it's at. I have it saved on my phone, the information. But I think it's Cheekwood or something like that. It's a, an estate. Or a hotel. I can't remember. But they have a jack-o'-lantern walkthrough thing. And it's like thousands of jack-o'-lanterns that are carved really intricate and lit up and stuff and I've been wanting to go to it the last few years and um, this year we might actually get to go on Sunday if Devin doesn't have to work so I'm hoping he doesn't have to work because I want to go okay I, th I thought I messed up my pattern when I wrote it but I was just reading it wrong <laughs> uh, 
Oh, I hate working little things, and I designed this pattern and myself, so it's my own fault that I'm having to do with these little tiny circles. <laughs> but it comes out cute, so it's all good, I guess. But yeah, so I'm trying to get this done today. I wanted to, but I'm not sure if I will. I might run out a lot before. Uh, it's just now a little after 2 right now, but it starts getting dark here around 5. This little good light starts going away. So, I don't know if I'll be able to continue this today. I'm going to get as much as I've done, as much as I can done, and then I will have to pick it up tomorrow, I guess. But let's see here. If I can get this done in the next few days, there will be two patterns coming out this weekend on my Etsy shop. It will be the whole pattern and then the jacket liner that I talked about in one of my videos. I'm releasing it separate in case someone just wants to make a little pumpkin jacket liner. And then in a couple weeks, maybe, I will have two more patterns coming out. And maybe more, I don't know. It all depends on um, the time I have to craft my own things. Um, I haven't really been making patterns other than those little turtles. And I might actually like some more of those tonight while watching TV because they're fun. And they're kind of mindless. And yeah, so I just wanted to hop in and talk for a few minutes. And then I'm going to try to finish these body parts to my amigurumi. And then I might go get something to eat because I'm hungry. I might make a sandwich or something. And tonight I'm cooking dinner. We got a new chicken bread to try. It's like a garlic parmesan one, which is always good. <laughs> but we're gonna, I'm gonna try it, and I have no idea what I'm gonna cook with it as a side dish because I don't know what I have <laughs> in there. I had some corn on the cob, but I, we ate it, and uh, I don't know what else we have. But I'll figure it out later. 